Joey Turbo, the opponent for the Annihilator. Fans in the main event, Kerry Cabrera and the Dominator in a return match and we're all looking forward to that one. They are engaged in a vicious feud following on from their contest in Felixstowe at the Easter weekend spectacular. Straight away there you see the Annihilator ripping up on the face of Joey Turbo who was quickly grounded there. The Annihilator appears to be methodical. Big shoulder barge to the midsection there and just stands on the back of the head taking his time and uh, toying with Joey Turbo by the looks of it. And as the fans look on, we've got so much coming up for you here on NCW UK Pro. As you see there, the Annihilator delivering a back elbow smash there, just wiping Turbo off his feet. And Turbo managing to duck under two there, and the Annihilator has caught him coming back in. Annihilator's got him up and drops him down hard. Nonchalant cover. And he's got him. Well, we took a look at the Annihilator fans recently. He is a methodical, big, tough, mysterious individual. And this, of course, is Leo Ice. And uh, the Annihilator is a late replacement, although probably not if you're Leo Ice, a welcome one, uh, for Humongous, who injured Leo back at the Easter weekend spectacular when he drilled him through a table. And uh, you may have seen on the NCW UK News Centre report that uh, Humongous has been indefinitely suspended from action as a result of the fact that he refused to pay the fine that was levied following the events with Leo Rice and uh, the Annihilator really is an unknown quantity so uh, Leo Rice won't have had any opportunities to scout his opponent he's not being cleared to wrestle uh, due to the fact that his injuries haven't fully recovered and already he's, um, despite his efforts to roll under and nip away from the Annihilator, he's finding himself in trouble here. The Annihilator stalking around and, uh, he drops the knee across the head. He is one strange individual. As I say, we know nothing about him. But uh, he appears to have that ability to run through his opponents like a freight train. As now with the Irish whip in. And uh, well, there's a nice head scissors manoeuvre from Leo Rice. And charging in with a back elbow there, span off that nicely, and this is the first time we've seen the Annihilator off his feet. Leo Rice has to capitalise on this, looks like he's going out for a high risk manoeuvre, he's on the top turnbuckle. And there's that perfect drop kick that we've seen from him before. That's rocked the Annihilator. Uh, well this could be, and yes he calls that combination the brain freeze, the two, and well the Annihilator just powered out of that as if it was nothing, and a deathly silence has fallen over these fans, as the Annihilator, uh, well he's just back in control now, throwing in some wild punches, it seemed that the, uh, even the brain freeze combination had no effect, put him up on his shoulder now, just drops down to the knees and uh, well he's ripped that shirt off of Leo Ice and, and uh, looks like Leo's got those ribs taped. 
And that was clearly a result of the injury he suffered at the hands of Humongous. Not recovering quickly from that. Annihilate has got him up and Leo has to do something here because, uh, well, there's that manoeuvre that we saw previously and that's it. The Annihilator victorious in this match with Leo Ice.